No, but Andy just came out and introduced us. I've been wanting to do that for years. Yeah. I know. <laughs> okay. You, you're going to sing this one so you get to introduce the song. Thank you. Please join the chorus. By the old Mulmain pagoda, looking lazy at the sea, there sits a little Burma girl, and I know she thinks of me. For the wind is in the palm trees, and the temple bells do say, Come ye back, ye British soldier, come ye back to Mandalay, come you back to Mandalay, where the old flotilla lay. Can't you hear those paddles chunking from Rangoon to Mandalay? On the road to Mandalay, where the flying fishes play, and the dawn comes up like thunder out of China across the bay. Her petticoat was yellow, and her little cap was green. And her name was Soupy Yorlap, just the same as Thebor's queen. And I seed her first to smoking on a whacking white cheroot, and a wasting Christian kisses on an heathen idol's foot. Blooming idol made of mud, what they called the great god Bud. Plucky lot she cared for idols. When I kissed her where she stood on the road to Mandalay, where the flying fishes play, and the dawn comes up like thunder out of China across the bay. When the mist was on the rice fields and the sun was dropping slow, she'd get her little banjo. And we'd sing kulalo lo with her arm upon me shoulder and her cheek again me cheek. We used to watch the steamers and the hathis pile in teak, elephants a pile in teak in that sludgy squudgy creek where the silence hung so heavy. You was half afraid to speak on the road to Mandalay. Where, where the, the flying fishes play, and, and the dawn comes, comes up like thunder out of China across the bay. Ah, but that's all shoved behind me, long ago and far away, for there aren't no buses running from the bank to Mandalay, and I'm learning here in London. What the ten-year soldier tells when you've heard the Easter calling, you won't never eat nor else. No, you won't eat nothing else. Ah, but them spicy garlic smells and the sunshine and the palm trees and them tinkly temple bells on the road to Mandalay, where, where the, the flying fishes play. And the dawn comes up like thunder out of China across the bay. I am sick of wasting leather on these gritty paving stones, and the blasted English drizzle wakes the fever in me bones. Though I walks with fifty housemaids out of Chelsea to the Strand. Well, they talks a lot of loving, but what do they understand? Beefy face and grubby hands. Lord, what do they understand? I've a sweeter, neater maiden in a cleaner, greener land on the road to Mandalay, 
Where the flying fishes play And the dawn comes up like thunder Out of China across the bay Ship me somewheres east of Suez Where the best is like the worst Where there aren't no Ten Commandments And a man can raise a thirst For the temple bells are calling and it's there that I would be By the old Moulmain pagoda Looking lazy at the sea On the road to Mandalay Where the flying fishes play With our sick beneath the awnings When we went to Mandalay On the road to Mandalay Where the flying fishes play and the dawn comes, comes up, up like thunder out of China, across the, the bay. bay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The road to Mandalay was nothing like I-91. <laughs> the road to Mandalay was the Irrawaddy River that went up and you can't actually from Mandalay see China out of because there's no bay there it's just a river uh, so but the bay where the estuary to the Irrawaddy is you can see China can you apparently <laughs> says so in a book John well it says so in a book but I think that's fake news myself <laughs> I don't know Thank you, Mr. President. <laughs> we, but that particular song was, uh, for those of you who may not know, because it was a long time ago that uh, Mr. Kipling was a former resident of, uh, of Brattleboro, of course. And the Actually, tune was said by Peter really. Bellamy, who was an occasional visitor to, 